If you haven't already, go and check out me and my fiance's gaming channel. The link will be in the description. Hey guys, it's Fantasia and welcome to another Sims 4 Seasons news video. So now, guys, Sims 4 Seasons, I think when this is going up, it's literally released in like 10 days. If this is going up when I plan it to. How exciting is that? Oh my goodness. Um, so, uh, obviously, as you guys know, EA Play just happened and there has been a little more information from EA Play. So, we're on the Sims community and um, I noticed this here posted 22 hours ago when I'm recording this. Um, and there is some exciting things. So, we're going to talk about it and everything. I'm really excited about these pictures. <laughs> okay. So, basically... Um, Oh, so the Brazilian fan site Sim Club have shared a couple screenshots. Um, and then as soon as we enter, create a sim and click to play, we can choose the seasons. Okay, so you can choose what season you start in. I did know that. They did talk about that. But um, there's a picture of the screen here. And then it says, when we choose the season, for example, spring, we do not see the season ready immediately. Only in the course of the game is that flowers bloom. Okay, um, that is on the first day of the season, we will see remnants of the previous seasons like trees still without the leaves oh that's so cool the snow although it has no depth it has a texture so apparently it does not have the same appearance um so this is the screen for like when you pick a season and i think this is so cute <laughs> Look how cute this is. I don't even know which one's my favorite. Obviously, the sun with a little face is adorable, but the spring one is really pretty. I love all of them, though. They're all pretty. Um, I love that. So, I don't know what season I'm going to be starting in. I kind of want to do summer. A lot of people want to do summer because it just, like, feels right since it's summer right now. But then also, like, it would be really cool to start in winter and have, like, all the snow. But then, I don't know. Like, I do kind of want to experience it from summer and then, like, see all the gradual changes. And summer is going to look different from how the game actually looks. I know, like, right now it always seems sunny and stuff. But the thing is, like, now they're going to have, like, pool parties and be, like, hot and heat waves and all this stuff. So I may start in summer. I don't know. We may I may start in different seasons for all my let's plays okay and then this screen here i have not seen at all so like i i did see this on twitter i didn't see it like up close like this so the so like this looks even better um but this i did not see so spring day one of seven by the way you can change the days but this is just like by default i think i'm gonna leave mine like this because if you think about it like a sim week does take a while to go by and since i do let's plays usually each part is like one sim day so that's seven parts for each season so i think that'll be good for me and i want like my kids in the game to experience like multiple seasons and obviously they're um you know, the lifespan for children is a lot shorter compared to like teens and adults. So yeah, um, I think we're going to leave it like that. And I love, this looks so cool. Like, look, this is like filled up a little bit and it like gradually fill up more and then switch to summer. Oh my goodness. The, see, this almost makes me want to start in spring because that also makes sense. Cause that's like the way the seasons go in. Obviously, you know, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. I'll kind of like roll with it when I first open up the game and we'll just see what I end up going with. Okay, so X Mirror Mirror actually shared this, which looks so cool. So it says, but that's not all. X Mirror Mirror also shared a couple images of the new scout badges on her Snapchat. Okay, so this, oh, I can't click on it. Well, anyways, um, this looks super cool. This, I'm like so curious to see more things about these badges give back like i can't even read what some of these say but like outdoor adventurer i'm really excited to play with these we haven't really heard much about these so this is exciting i feel like this pack has like so much to offer i'm so excited okay um from what we know your sims will earn their scout badges through completing certain tasks yeah i did hear that as well so that's really cool um and then rory shared this clip ah okay so she obviously got to play seasons at ea play and she has a little clip here of snow falling um so let's go ahead and look at that oh my god it's real loud let's turn it down but look at the snow falling oh my god look it's pretty clear but obviously she's recording her screen so like imagine how this actually looks when you're looking at the screen this probably looks beautiful with the snowflakes falling i love um so that's actually it but then actually let's take a step back there's more stuff but there's no like more pictures and things like that but there's just some like 
what is this? A quick overview. As well as we have already mentioned, above uh, above fans who have attended EA Play um, have shared their experiences with the expansion. And one user on Reddit who goes by the name B Team North, I guess, is what it is. Um, okay, so I'm actually really pleased with the way weather turned out. The effects are beautiful. So excited to see. I love, love, love the calendar. I did notice that if you plan an event from your phone, it doesn't give you the option to plan in the future, which is dumb. Maybe it'll be patched. I'm so excited to build. Really excited to add The Sims 4 Seasons to my game. So maybe it will be patched, but maybe it's because the phone still works the same as always. But like if you do it on the calendar, you can plan in advance. I really don't mind that because I think I'm going to be using the calendar for literally everything. Like I think I'm going to plan everything on there and like never use the phone to plan an event again. Like if I don't have to, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> So, I don't know. Um, disappointed that there are virtually no new wall or floor options. Oh, but those glass roofs. I kind of wish there was, but I get more excited with the furniture. So, like, I'm dying to see all the furniture. They're perfect. <laughs> if anyone has any questions, let me know. Okay, so that's basically everything. Um, okay, you guys. So, out of these things, what made you the most excited? I think this made me most excited because I haven't seen this screen, like, at all yet. Um, I'm just really excited. Also, like, here's the new uh, UI thing down here, which is super cool. Um, e okay. <laughs> so, yeah, um, comment down below what are your thoughts and everything, and I will definitely have more news videos if we see some more stuff. I'm assuming we're gonna find out some more things, um, especially once the live stream comes, and also, like, everyone is back from EA Play Now, or maybe they're yeah, I'm pretty sure when this is going up, they should all be back. Um, either way, um, and maybe I don't know when they can share things or anything like that, but I'm just excited to see more like screens like this, just like the little things. Super excited. So, anyways, you guys, I'm gonna wrap this up here. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you guys are all having an amazing, amazing day. And don't forget to leave some positivity down below. I love you guys all so, so much, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Listen up, there's not a thing that I can't get from you Boy, I don't need that much, neither